so I, I forgot to um, record it, but basically these are the cleats that, um, that we fit on there, the one here and one here. So this cleat I'm using for the boom, just to kind of let be able to adjust whereabouts that is for the track. Um, as you can see, I've moved the track here and I've moved it from here to here, just so it's, it aligns better with the track. And also the boom actually doesn't now hit my head, but that did. <laughs> Everything is just easy. Obviously here's, here's the reefing line. Ah, I said the reefing line. So I've put a single line reefing set up in, um, but I've got it tied to this side and it runs through this side, which is obviously chafing. But the second we get somewhere where I can buy some blocks that aren't too expensive, the the blocks at last place were a little bit pricey. Yeah, we'll wait. We'll wait to get um, some more blocks that aren't just too expensive. But at the moment, yeah, it runs down and um, goes to the back and then goes down to the side. Obviously, it's a bit baggy right now, but I quite I prefer that than just a little bit too tight. And then the tacking lines, one there which goes to the back cleat. And then I use the I use the other cleat here as that one, and I've obviously replaced the lines as well. Um, this setup is a thousand times better than what we we're using before. Um, obviously now we can we can reef without this collapsing, because um, now we've got our top of lift, which is awesome. Yeah, another absolutely lovely day. And uh, this is actually Mon and Lou's 12, 12 year anniversary, so it's a pretty special day for us. And I mean, I feel like we've been reward with this immaculate day as well obviously it's not too sunny but on this bike we have no canopy so you don't want it too sunny but yeah lovely day Oh my god! Oh. Lou! Lou, there's so many! Oh my god, I, get, I think I've got to get in the water. Oh my god. Actually, no, I'll stay up here. Wow. Oh my god. My no, 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 this is there. You're actually coming towards me. Oh my god! Oh. oh look 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 run deep us look oh. there's dolphins <laughs> No, that was that was amazing. I was it was a bit hard trying to keep an eye on where they were because they moved it down quickly. But that was absolutely incredible. No other boats around. There was like four <laughs> pods. Oh my god! Oh my god, what's up, these, these dolphins are mental! <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my god! 
I couldn't see anything. Yeah, they were all here. No. Like two coming this way and then there was one coming up. That was unbelievable. Those dolphins are like charging at the boat. I hope I am praying that you could see you could see him on the GoPro. Oh this is by far the most we've ever had. Hey look, they're actually coming back this way. Oh, they were so close. There was like 50 of them. There were so many dolphins. That must have been the pods that we saw earlier. Maybe, yeah. Oh man, that was amazing. <laughs> Bloody hell, there was there was so many of them. What a relaxing day we've had. Yes, just quite. Oh, relaxing until the dolphins came. Yeah, that was good. I know we keep saying it and we keep expressing how this is why we brought the boat. But it is. We've done this all on an extremely tight budget. We knew we were never going to be able to get a large amount of money to be able to buy something in the £50,000 range, never mind millions. But or even 10,000. <laughs> 10, we were messing around with like three to 4,000 and we were very lucky to get the boat at 3,800 that we did. It wasn't up for that for sale, but the owner, the previous owner, Nick, he came down a fair bit with the trust that we would restore the boat and not just sail it for one season, get rid of it. He was, he's had it for 10 years. He wanted to see it kind of be brought back to life and not wasted. We are, that's the point of this. We, we, we're getting to have these amazing days for very little money. I know we had the engine issue. That was kind of our fault, really. Do a bit of research in engines, make sure you get it serviced before you go anywhere. The previous owner told us to do that. We were like, ah, oh, it's fine. Um, that's who I am, unfortunately. You can buy cheap boats, that's cheap sailboats. You've just got to be prepared to do a small amount of work inside and, 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 be, and be prepared to learn um, and learn quick. the first cosy experience we've had in Italy. Mm. This is actually like super cosy right now. Yeah. Yeah. Getting to put some clothes on. <laughs> yeah it's not cold but it's it's not hot is it? Mm. So this this must be like 20 degrees maybe 21. So yeah it's about 22. 20 yeah about 22. So it's not cold it's just a lot cooler. Mm. Enough for a cardigan a hat and a <laughs> she had goosebumps like 10 minutes ago. Goosebumps in like 22 degrees. It's quite nice though. That's when you know you're spoiled rotten. Yeah. For, for the weather. Mm. Also, we've now got into a habit of trying to find dolphins everywhere. <laughs> Every little ripple in the sea looks like a dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> Cold, you know, it's got a bit of water on me. That was that's a little bit cold of normal. All right, well, I know there's not jumping in this time. So dark, you actually can't see so anything. Ah, <laughs> oh, there you go. A lovely light. Shut the door on your way out. Dinner time. Oh my god. 
bad. My favourite food. <laughs> And the wine. Nine cents wine or something. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. It actually tastes really good. <laughs> Doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Yeah, actually, it tastes like really good. <laughs> oh my god. Good morning. <laughs> It's so blue. <laughs> it's so blue. Whee! Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> is it cold? How blue it is. So you can just see a little sailboat over there somewhere, but right next to us is Castle, I don't know the name of it right now, but I'm sure I'll tag it. How stunning is that? Look at the rock formations around it. only imagine the history of this place. It'd have been incredible. Imagine trying to defend that. There's no way actually for us to get up right now. Um, they've put like a little path in apparently, but they've closed it off. So how would have they got up there beforehand? Um, yeah. Quite small though. I mean, really it's quite small for a defensive point. What an amazing bay to protect. Once again, we have found ourselves staying somewhere for a few days and uh, I don't think anyone can blame us given the location. It's particularly gorgeous. Okay, that was the access and yep, they blocked it off. What a shame. Cool little beach there. This has turned into a big old trek. It's meant to be a 30 minute quick walk, but yeah, we're hiking up hills to get up there basically. <laughs> Doing us good, so. We needed it. We needed it. We just kicked the kids out of the park. <laughs> Showed them his boss. Yeah, there they are. Bugger off. <laughs> 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 it's literally the best swing, so they were just here. We didn't just start drinking in front of them to push them away. I assure you. Look at that view. And you can see our Morgana down there, look. The only sailboat out there. Look at the castle there, what an amazing scenery. And we've got an arch over there. Home sweet home. <laughs> Put the lights on. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, 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 turn the lights on, the, the red lights. 
It's really uh, lit up the place. I love it. <laughs>